final farewell for a fallen police officer. A police procession led the hearse carrying the body of Officer Justin Weinbrenner through Akron today. He was off duty when he was shot and killed Sunday at Papa Don's bar while trying to protect others from a gunman. Now friends and family are lining up to pay their respects. News Channel 5's Bob Jones is live at Rhodes Arena. Bob, what a tremendous show of support for Officer Weinbrenner. Well, thousands of people have made their way into Rhodes Arena to pay their final respects. On the video scoreboard behind me, there are several pictures of Justin Weinbrenner dissolving one by one. And with the family's blessing today, we talked with mourners about this community's great loss. The lines were long and hearts heavy. Many of the Akron men and women in blue were first to pay their respects to Officer Justin Weinbrenner, the officers who protect all of us feeling vulnerable, but there is nowhere else they would be comforting their fallen brother's family. Uh, I think today's going to be the daunting day where you actually look at our brother officer. It was for me. When one of us bleeds, we all bleed. U.S. So, Marshal uh, Pete Elliott came with his Honor Our Fallen wristband, something he wears every day. We're one brotherhood, and I don't care if you're on the federal level, the local level, the state level, um, no matter what department you are with, uh, we are one team. Weinbrenner was just 32 years old and loved being a cop. He was engaged and leaves behind a four-year-old daughter. Friends will remember his contagious laugh and smile. Several pictures and video displays captured who he was and how he lived. It was hard. Linda Anger was Justin's neighbor when he was growing up. He was just a wonderful man. Wonderful, wonderful. Can't say can't say enough about him. The day was difficult. The police procession from the funeral home to the arena where the Akron Honor Guard waited stoically. And for many, the reality of saying goodbye to the man who wore badge 1301 really hit home today. The name and the ID 1301 matter, but it could have been anybody on my shift or anybody on another shift. Uh, it affects all of us the same. And you can see many people are offering their condolences right now to Officer Weinbrenner's father. He is a retired Barberton police officer. The funeral is here at the arena tomorrow morning, 10 a.m. And after the funeral, they will stop briefly at Akron Police Headquarters, where all of the officers who work on Officer Weinbrenner's shift will stop and salute him. Live in Akron tonight, Bob Jones, News Channel 5. Such beautiful tributes for Officer Weinbrenner. And one more, the Browns are honoring him with a special jersey. The team sent his family a custom shirt with his last name stitched on it. Weinbrenner never missed a Browns game and always wore a jersey with Crime Dog on the back.